We're in beautiful Oxford, Michigan, installing a French drain system, and we're running underground downspouts. Want to take this time to show you what to look for as far as how much water each downspout is responsible for, as far as roof runoff when you're dealing with sheet water. And I also wanted to use this opportunity to show you how when you have a blue sky, no clouds, and direct sun, I wanted to show you the power of radiant energy. It's in the low 20s, yet the roof runoff here is, I mean, the sun's out, it's just melting all the snow. So this gutter trough appears to be rather short, and you'd think, okay, that's not a lot of water for this downspout. However, the second story always dumps into the first story gutter troughs. That's the way the systems all are. So keep that in mind if you have a two-story house, if you're a DIY guy, or if you're a drainage contractor. You can see, here we are again. You know, it's in, in the low 20s, I don't know, 23, 24 degrees right now. And you can just see how much the snow has melted off the roof, how much water is coming out of these downspouts. And this is, you know, we're, we're 10 degrees below freezing. Again, the power radiant energy, here we go, direct sunlight. So this is where we end up in trouble. Say this was happening and we were another 10 degrees colder. These downspouts would just build up with ice because the metal is so cold as the water runs off the rooftop it just freezes them solid and that's why you hear me say I don't care what you pipe this with doesn't matter if it's you know SDR pipe it, it's gonna crack here in Michigan that's why we use dual wall corrugated pipe or single wall corrugated pipe it expands when the ice builds up, it'll expand, and when it thaws, it contracts. So, some great examples. And when you're sizing your system, always look to see, again, this gutter run, this one here doesn't appear to be too threatening, but there's the downspout from the second story. And touch screen ain't working because my fingers are too cold. So there's a lot of water that's been running off the second story into the first story gutter trough along with all the snow that melted. So during a rain, this is known as sheet water. And when you have sheet water on a hard rain coming off the second story onto the first story, and you're also collecting the first story water in that gutter trough, this downspout suddenly is responsible for hundreds if not thousands of gallons of water per rain event. To learn more about underground drainage systems and yard dewatering, subscribe. If you're looking for this service in southeastern Michigan, give us a call.